Somebody help my baby. Milton, what are you doing? Now you're all covered in grass. Milton. Oh, good boy. Good boy. Oh, gosh. Diddy. Dee Dee. Dee Dee. Morning, guys. I am up. I am Adam. And today's leg day. I'm not really excited about it, but I'm trying to pump myself up. Do you know what has helped me get pumped this morning? So, long story short, long story long, right? So you guys know I love Zip Fizz, right? It is just my jam, it is my OG, it is bae, right? But it's also expensive. <laughs> so I'll just kind of run out of it. And so instead of buying more just yet, because I will be buying it, right? I always get electrolyte powder sent to me from different companies. Most recently, it's Key Nutrients Electrolytes. This is their watermelon flavor. It's really good. I like Key Nutrients, but it doesn't have caffeine. And I love having caffeine in my pre-workouts. So, I went to Amazon, bought some liquid caffeine, right? The link is in the description to my Amazon store if you wanna get some caffeine. I just got some liquid caffeine, added it to my drink, and like, I'm hype right now. and it is working so well. Granted, this is the first day I've had caffeine in a while because none of the other electrolytes have caffeine. So I basically turned my electrolyte powder into a pre-workout. So I've been drinking that and like, I'm a little jittery. I think I started off with a little too much, but like, I'm a, I put some more water in there, but it's feeling good. Like, that's just like a really good way to make your own pre-workout, like buy caffeine add it to your favorite pre-workout or powder beverage, right? And boom, energy drink. So I'm hoping that gives me energy to do leg day. I don't know what I'm gonna do. I would probably be a lot better if I followed a YouTube video, but I'm not going to today because I'm on Clubhouse listening right now and I like being a part of these conversations, but I gotta make sure I work out. So today is leg day. I'm having my pre-workout and I'm feeling good. Leg out. done with leg day. I did about 30 minutes. I was super proud of myself. Now I'm on my bike and I'm about to finish. Look how long I've been on my bike. You can't see it. So don't worry. I'm taking my watch off so you can see it. Okay. You can't see my heart rate because it's not on my wrist right now, but look at that. Nearly an hour. I'm going to cap this off at an hour. Woo. And I feel great. Oh, also unapologetically keto right now. That's what I am right now. Are you? Are you? Go to IamKetoStrong.com. Link is in the description. Get you a tank top. Get your entire life. Look, I'm wearing this inside, but nothing gives me more like swag than when I'm wearing this at the gym and I'm over there accomplishing big things. I'm like, yeah, you wish you was keto. Don't worry about it. But still, IamKetoStrong.com. Okay, I'm about to be done with this. On to the next. Okay guys, we are on our way to the grocery store. This is our normal routine. We go to Costco, we get all our hashtag bulk items, mm -hmm. and then we go to Mar and we get our actual grocery items. Mm -hmm. We are actually about to drive right past an Aldi. We do not go there just no, because, look, they have some good items and maybe we'll do an Aldi haul. Like, you know, let's go check and see what they got. Mm -hmm. But for the most part, they don't have everything. They don't have enough to where we could not go to Meyer, right? Yeah. And so we'd end up having to go to Costco and to Aldi and to Meyer, and it's just like, it ain't worth it. We can just go to, we can go to Mar. 
I'm gonna go to Myers and leave Aldi's off the map, right? Yeah, you got so this. okay. So we are headed out. Bye Aldi, love you. So uh fun. and then yeah, we'll get some shopping. Honestly, yep. I'm not getting a lot because today is chicken day. Yep. I'm having chicken. Exactly. I don't need to buy anything, right? Exactly. So it's just getting ready for next week. So you'll see what I get. It's not a lot, I'll tell you that. So. We got you. Okay, so um we'll see you later. Peep bye. It is time for me to eat. Today is a fasting day, right? Uh, whereas, you know, on Protein Sparing Modified Fast, you don't actually go without eating anything. Like, I'm used to alternate day fasting, where you legitimately don't eat anything on your fasting day, right? So, doing Protein Sparing Fasting seems like a treat. It's like, wait a minute, I'm fasting, but I still get to eat? Like, what? So I can understand where if you're truly used to eating every day, you're just like, oh my God, going a day with only this many calories. But for me, it really seems like a treat. So on my protein sparing modified fasting days, that's long. On my fasting days, I just have chicken. Just chicken breast. You know, I've seen all these complicated recipes about things you can have on your fasting days, like bread and just seafood. Like I, no, 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 no legitimately on my fasting days all I have is about a pound and a half of chicken and two tablespoons of butter so I'm gonna show you how I make that right now okay so the good thing about the Costco like individually sealed bags of chicken is that they always come with two chicken breasts every single time now I'm really proud of myself for not being super duper anal about the macros because even though the weight in the bag only varies like four ounces, you know, part of me was considering I can really only have one pound eight ounces. So if I, if I weigh a bag and it weighs one pound ten ounces, I'm going to have to cut a little piece off. Or if I weigh a bag and only has one pound six ounces, I'm going to have to like open another one and add it. Like I don't do that. The bags only vary by four ounces sometimes. So sometimes I might have a little more protein. Some days I might have a little less protein, right? Like I just eat the two chicken breasts that come in the bag. So look, these are two mighty large chicken breasts and they are going to cook up to be a lot of food. gentlemen the category is protein sparing modified fast it's giving me high protein it's giving me low fat it's giving me essentially no carbs whatsoever other than the spices you know what I'm saying look how much chicken those two chicken breasts turn into like it is a platter of meat it is a platter of chicken meat as you can see, all I did, I spiced up the chicken in some sugar-free spices. All of those spices were sugar-free. I put them on the stove. I just 
sauteed them basically. After they were on the stove for a while, I took them off and put them on a cutting board and then I cut them into little chunks. Look, I like to cut my chicken and then put it back on the stove so that even more of the surface area gets covered with the heat, right? Because I want to dry out this meat. You guys know me, I love dry meat, right? Also, you saw me pour a little bit of water in there from time to time just to kind of loosen up the bits that were on the bottom of the, the skillet, like, and it turned into this. When I tell you this is just chicken, olive oil, spices, and water, and boy, oh, and hot sauce, right? Because you know I got to have my hot sauce. When I tell you this stuff is delicious, look at that. Mmm. Mmm. Oh, it's so salty. It's spicy. Look. Contrary to what you think, it's juicy. I put a ton of water in there. But the flavors, the spices, mm-hmm. This will go nuts on some fajitas, but like, I'm not doing all that. It's just chicken day. This is like 800 calories worth of chicken. And a little bit from the olive oil, some fat from the olive oil. But this is all protein, like, Protein sparing, modified fasting, nailed it. When I tell y'all, I don't even use a fork. Y'all see me picking up these pieces, eating them by hand? This is exactly what I do. Mm-hmm. And the parts that were on the outside got like this great little burnt crust. Like, I killed this. So I'm just gonna go eat this entire plate of chicken with my hands. And I'll be watching Crime Scene Kitchen. So we're coming up to the finale. It's actually just like the perfect definition of summer TV. It's a reality competition show starring real people, bakers from around the country. They have to go to a kitchen where a dish was prepared. So they call it a crime scene. I was like, it should be more like used kitchen or dirty kitchen. Like there's not a crime committed there. There was no murder, but it's just a dish was prepared and they have to use the clues to determine what dish so it's like oh you can smell something and say oh that smells like lemon must be lemon oh here's some egg whites so that must mean a meringue was made right just different things like that they have to deduce what dish was made and then they have to make that dish joel McHale is hosting it and it is the definition of feel-good tv so i'm gonna go eat my delicious chicken mm. And when I tell y'all, this is, this is all I'm going to have today. My eating window will be closed after this, but I definitely have a Zevia, so I'll check back in. Yes, please. Good evening. Okay, I'm having a Zevia to finish up the day. This is orange. I alternate between orange and lemon lime. It's just one of my favorite things ever. Like, it is super sweet and satisfying, and it only has Stevia in it. Look. Zero sugar, caffeine free. Lord knows I need that today, right? Um, but overall, today's been a great day. I drank my water with the lemon in it. Like, I've been killing it today. I'm telling you, I'm completely satisfied with that chicken. Like, I have not even thought about food the rest of the day. Boy, when I tell you, in the words of Destiny's Child, ain't no feeling like being free, okay? Let me know in the comments down below if you remember that song. Destiny Fulfilled was a great album. Come at me, bro. What I mean by free is just like free of constantly thinking about food, free of being hungry and not even hungry. And once again, it's just thinking about food because I'm rarely hungry. My body is rarely telling me I'm hungry, but it's just this nagging mental dissatisfaction that I've had, right? Like, oh, I wish I could eat more. Why, girl? Why do you wish you could eat more? Like, your body's not even hungry. So, <sighs> this protein sparing modified fasting they really need to come up with a shorter name but like it has really just flipped my mind back around and i feel absolutely great i just got notified that i am late for a call so i am hopping on a one-on-one -on -one call with one of my favorite patrons ever if you're interested in becoming a patron and either joining a one-on-one -on -one call with me a month or we have a joint group patron call now that's fun we have a joint call every month you can click the link in the description to learn how to become a patron it is super lit over there but i gotta get on my call now to talk to one of my bffs and um i'll talk to you guys later probably just to sign off because like i said i'm done for the day i got nothing else my zevia my chicken i'm done hi donut boy so this is the only type of donut that's allowed in this house oh good night angel oh did he Oh, Diddy and his donut.
So it's 10 o'clock and as suspected, after I had my orange Zevia, mm -hmm. I had some water and that was about it. Like, you saw what I eat on a fasting day. Chicken, that's it. And it is so filling, it's so easy to make. You just cook the mm -hmm. chicken. Mm -hmm. Right? Season it very thoroughly. You season it thoroughly, right? You cook so, the chicken. So you're coughing in the kitchen. <laughs> and then... Look, some of them season is, they be spicy. When the spice hops up out the pan, mm -hmm. it does it does cause you to, mm -hmm. you know, cough a little bit. So, so it is it is quite a smoky house sometimes. Yes. But like, um, other than that, today was yep. a great I day. Did, did I, some awesome I exercising. Ate a bunch of chicken. Get your shirt together. Get your shirt together, Richard. They nice. show the brand. You do yeah. gotta show the brand. You're getting for a little apologetically keto. Ah! <laughs> Please, someone comment down below and answer the question why did I marry him? Like, let me know in the comments down below. Because I swear I'll be forgetting sometimes. <laughs> So, I mean, we're about to like watch 10 seconds of television because mm -hmm. I'm gonna go to sleep very soon. No, wait, but today was a productive day. It was yes. absolutely awesome. Yes. Thank you so much for watching. Are you doing protein sparing modified fasting? Are you familiar with the concept? What do you have on your fasting day? Because as you saw, for me, simple works the best. Yeah. Like just keep it simple, Straight keep simple. it delicious, and and I love it. It's working well for me. Thanks so much for watching. And don't forget, subscribe to our channel, Watch Autumn Keto. And we'll see you next time. Yep. Bye. Bye. Oh, my arm hurts. Oh, my arm. I know. Whew. I did, did biceps. You're so cute. Please leave me alone. Whatever you were going to do, whatever you were going to do. Oh, Donut Diddy. Oh, donut boy. Hey. Milton. Milton, come on. Milton, what are you doing? Milton.